track position, but the seven trying to take the lead for the first time. And this is the and first he time. Does it. Yeah, this is the first time we've seen Justin Algar have a good start. He was on the bottom lane. I think that was part oh, of it. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. John Underneemanchek. It looked like he was wrecked yeah, by his out. teammate Chandler Smith. Now they're wrecking all over at the front of the field, guys. That was a big wreck. That was a big wreck. You know what? Everything goes back to the pit stop with the 81. The 81 was a little bit frustrated. He, he thought that he needed to get into stuff quick. And he just got into a little bit tight spot right there in the middle between his teammate and the 98. You see Riley Herbst involved there. John a lot of good cars. Gosh. Haley Deegan. Have to wait for a replay to see what happened. Riley Herbst with some damage there. Quite a bit there in the left rear. Oh, oh same man. Man. Again. All the rays, man. Front from him. And he got his fired way there. up. Still got a fire. Jeb Burton. Jeb Burton there. That's a lot of fluid right it's there. A long caution there. Uh, he's left rear is killed. That escalated quickly. John Hunter Nemechek Seems to with me the lead. Like he, he can't believe it either. Look. <laughs> oh, he can't believe it. <laughs> what was that? I don't know what was that, but he's no very Was happy. that like we're driving crazy? Uh, what are we doing? Is it John it's... Hunter Nemechek just coming off a good restart there, winning last week. That was his stop. He, that was his position right there, man. He he was on, on the lead. He had a, a good restart, and, and he just got put in a bad spot right there. Parker Retzloff. Gosh. Both well, Jordan Anderson cars tied up in this one. Gosh, Sam Mayer, what a bummer. Trying for his first top 10 of the season. Drove his way up, and let's see where it went wrong here. You see him, the three wide coming off the corner. Pretty tight. You know, John Hunter definitely squeezes them down a little bit. And he just kind of run out of real estate. <sighs> I mean, he already started spinning when he finished them off. I, it's just, I mean, it's racing. It's racing, man. It's racing. I think it's a combination of things. Obviously, the 81 got, you know, himself in a very, very tight hole. The 20 didn't like that. And he pins him down on exit. And the 81 didn't have a, didn't have a way to go, unfortunately, because then the, the 98 was right on his left rear as well. Mm. Let's get a look from our... Yeah, I mean, I mean, I mean, it's tight. I mean, you yeah. see that Chandler was getting, you know, hit from the inside and it's kind of getting bounced around a lot there. And gosh, once he gets into, you know, those cars on the bottom, you're, just, you're sitting in the middle of the racetrack and here comes all these cars right at you. Look at Parker just hoping to get just by there. Look oh, Eric save. Almarola getting in it. So William Byron into the wall. Yeah, that's, oh, that's Parker tough one. Parker Redslaw just destroyed up at the wall. You know, you know who did a great job? Parker Kligerman right yes, there. Yes, he did. I mean, sometimes the best move is to do not move. <laughs> just <laughs> wait for things to settle and then you make your adjustment. Look at him. He's still slowing down. But you and, watch uh, his hands. Yeah, yeah, he was he's studying the he, whole thing. Because he's slowing down, so the car is moving when he's slowing down, but he did a and great job. And avoids another one. He is, he, that's Hertz. experience right there. Well done, Parker Kligerman. He's right on board with John Hunter. Man, from, under, uh, from that uh, angle, it doesn't look like he was pinching him down. I mean, he wasn't his racing line. So violent from that angle. Yeah, I mean, you just, I mean, you're, you're, it, like we said, it's, it's tight coming off the corner there. You, you're, you're three wide. I mean, everybody's into each other. Late race restart. At the front of the field, though. That's yeah. and that's third on back. For everybody, think about this. You're going straight, There's, and you're directly behind another car. You can't see where the wreck's evolving to, like where it's going to go next. Like it's like it's just smoke in front of you, and all you can do is slow down. But the next guy runs in the back of you, and it just becomes a really tricky spot when everyone's that close to each other. A lot of like wrecked race cars. We're told. I believe 11 cars with damage. William Byron there, left front damage. We, we saw him get squeezed into the fence a little bit, and the 20's still running, but obviously a lot of damage there. 